What's the craziest thing you ever did for love? Just take a listen to this. I took a charge for a guy. I'm sorry, what? You took a charge? Yeah. What charge? It was a uh, break and entering. Huh? It was a uh, break and entering. Hey, whoa! Hey! <laughs> Why did you do that? I don't know. I was stupid. What's going on guys? You already know it's your boy M to the A to the C to the K-A-Y-5 back again with another video. Today's question is what's the craziest thing you did for love? It's just that simple. Really? It's not that hard. So we're going going around asking people what's the craziest thing you ever did for love? Make sure you stay tuned and watch this video to the end. Be sure to like, be sure to comment, be sure to subscribe if you haven't done that yet and be sure to turn on post notifications so you can get notified when I post videos. Thank you very much. Enjoy this one. Uh, what's your name? Uh, Wilson. Wilson. What's yours? Ray. Ray. Yeah. And uh, your brothers, right? Oh, we're just friends. Oh, friends. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And where are you from? I'm from Charlotte. Yeah, yeah from Charlotte, Charlotte as well. Yeah. So the question of the day is, what's the craziest thing you ever did for love? What's up? The craziest thing I ever did for love? Yes. <laughs> That's a good one. I don't know. I feel like uh, back in college, like driven six hours or something like that to go see somebody. Oh, yeah. okay. And how did that feel? I mean, good at the time, but I probably wouldn't do it now. <laughs> <laughs> and why would you do it now, though? Just because, I mean, I don't, you I don't, don't like the person anymore. So <laughs> y'all broke up already and stuff? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And wh why? For you to do something like that, that means you must have loved, you must have loved the person so much. Uh, yeah, I, mean, I don't know. I guess just in the moment, it felt like the right thing to do, but then... I've done it before, too. So yeah, I, yeah, I, I yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, what was that? I mean, I was going to say drove three hours, but he yeah. trumps me. <laughs> <laughs> so, why did you do it, though? Uh, I mean, again, it felt right. It felt like, you know, kind of like a big like gesture kind of thing. Like, okay. So uh, was it like a long distance type of relationship? Uh, yeah, I mean, it's like, you know, gearing up to like leave for school and stuff, like okay. that kind of thing, yeah. What's the craziest thing you did for love? Um, <laughs> the craziest thing? Uh, I guess I, I guess I have to say get married, man. Oh my God! Wow! Oh, I got, yeah, yeah, I'm married. <laughs> and why you call, why you think that's the craziest thing though? Oh um, my, there's not a lot of people doing it nowadays, you feel me? So, you know, it's a big, a big risk, but you know, if it's the right one, then, you know, uh, I think, I think that's when it's right. So, so how did you know she was the right one? Um, you know, just a lot of, just been through a lot of stuff together and, um, you know, she held me down when times was hard and whatnot. And, uh. You know, she just stuck around and made sure I'm straight. I made sure she's straight, you know. So um, that's how I knew. That's how I knew. But we've been together for a while before we got married. Before so, got you know. married. so you knew that was, a, that, was, that was the woman you wanted to be with. Right, right, right. So, okay. you know, she pretty much stood the test of time. And, um, you know, I was able to, to, to get down on one knee and, and make that leap. Nice. You feel me? Okay. So, so what's your advice for men that are looking to get married? Man, I would say um, don't rush, you know, okay. just don't rush, take your time, make sure she's the right one. My nigga. <laughs> um, you know, make sure that, that y'all right for each other and uh, just support each other and everything. And, um, you know, just don't, don't rush into it. You know, it's not, it's a marathon, not a race. Thank you. You know, it's not a sprint. It's, it's going to be forever, basically. Right, yeah. right, right. So you gotta make sure like the person is your friend first. That's that's what I did. Um, I made sure we was friends. We was pretty much doing everything together and uh, taking trips and you know doing everything. So now you know we had a spot where we good, we good and uh, we married and still take trips, still friends, still do everything we did before. But it's more solidified. So basically, you marry your best friend. Right, right, exactly. What's the craziest thing you ever did for love? I don't think I did nothing crazy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>
<laughs> so you don't have anything crazy you did for love like you love them you love the guy so much and you just had to you, you did it and it was you think it's the craziest uh, think about it for a second I took a charge for a guy. That's the way you talk. Repeat and make it. I took a charge for a guy. Guy! <laughs> you took a charge? Yeah. What charge? It was uh, breaking and entering. <laughs> Why did you do that? I don't know. I was stupid and young. How long ago was that though? Like a year ago. Really? <laughs> And are y'all still together? No. And what happened? Like, why y'all not together though? If you have done something that crazy, why why do y'all break like, up? After I just realized he wasn't for me, so I just broke up. Period. With him. And did you go to jail for that? Yeah. Well, I didn't go to jail, but I got hold it, detained. Yeah. <laughs> Damn. So are you dating right now? No. Why? Cause I just want to be single and free, you know. <laughs> <laughs> is there niggas I shit or is that what it is? Yeah, that's, that's part of it. Yeah. What's the craziest thing you ever did for love? Um, I bought a almost four hundred dollar Lego set for him. I'm sorry, what? Uh, a Lego what? Lego set for him. Mm -hmm. And why did you do that? Because he loves it. I just like I'm that type of person. Like if you like sentimental things, I do sentimental things for someone. Oh my God! Wow! Okay. And how did you feel when you, when you did it? Oh, happy. Like, you I didn't happy? regret it or anything. You didn't feel like, yeah, I just spent $400 nope. and ah. Nope. Okay, I don't regret so it. you really love him. Yeah, like, I'll buy anything. Like, if I know he would like it, I'll just buy it. Wow, that's so sweet. <laughs> and um, how long y'all been together for? Six months today. Wow. But we've known each other for, like, three years. And why did it take y'all so long to, to uh, date? Ask him. <laughs> were y'all like friends before y'all started dating um we went to high school together and then it was just like i went to college and so we just happened to come right, back together so do you think y'all might get married maybe yeah we're gonna get married nice no, 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 no there's doubts. no doubt about it no we're gonna get married <laughs> are you sure yeah i know Okay, that's really good. I really, I really love seeing couples happy and all that yeah. stuff, though. So you said the craziest thing you did for love was to get him a four hundred dollar gift. Mhm. Mm okay. I wish someone can get me a four hundred dollar gift. I would buy. He's just a, he's a sneakerhead, so I would like buy him shoes. Oh, he, he has a lot of sneakers. Oh my god. Okay, that's that's good. That's really good. Okay. So what's the craziest thing someone has ever done for love for you, though? That you think. I did get tickets to a Panthers playoff game as like a present, which I know they were expensive. How, like, how much? How much is that? Do you think? Do you have an idea? Uh, it was it was the like 2015 season uh, so Cardinals we good, game. Yeah, yeah we were good. <laughs> I think they were pretty expensive. I have no idea. So you think that was the craziest thing someone did? Probably, yeah. How about yourself? I wish I got Panthers tickets, <laughs> but. Uh, <laughs> okay, what's yours? I'm not sure. That's a good question. I mean, I guess just driving six hours yeah yeah not driving six hours oh she drove six hours too yeah i mean i guess just back and forth yeah damn if that's okay. one way or the other yeah okay well thank y'all very much and that's just a question of the day what do you think about women that feel entitled to a man's money entitled to their money to um, a man's money yeah what do you think about that yeah I, I don't agree with that thank you i don't agree with that i think um you know my money my, my money's my money your money's your money and again if we're working together, we can bring both to the, the table, you know, yes, both pots yeah. to the table and put it together, you know, but just because I make money doesn't, doesn't mean, mean that, that it's your money, you know, like. Just because you're a female doesn't mean I have to give you. Right, you right. You deserve Especially it. Yeah. Nowadays, you know, it's a lot of independent women out there and everything, right. they're making their own money. So it's like, you know, you can't just keep your money and spend all and my spend money, you feel exactly, what I'm saying? Like, exactly. You can't do that, it's not right, so. Right. You so know, you don't, you don't think it's right. Basically. No, no, I don't think it's right. But I think if um if both people are bringing something to the table, right. it doesn't have to be money. But you know, if she's holding you down, and you know, you could take care of her or whatever, and financially or whatever. If she's helping you emotionally, or whatever. Then um I think it's okay to spend some money on her, take care of her, things that. like that. Yeah. But you know, if she's not doing anything, then she doesn't deserve it. You yeah, know, she don't exactly, deserve it. Yeah, so. Yeah. No, I can't agree with that one, you know. <laughs> okay, well, thank you very much. And right. that's just the uh, question of the day. Appreciate okay. it. Thank you. What's the craziest thing someone ever did f for you for love? Um, 
so I'm very spiritual so he like he's very into crystals with me so like that's crazy for me because a lot of people are just like they brush it off and think it's weird so I guess that's the craziest thing so what's the craziest thing again he buys crystals and crystals stuff for, me. for you yeah. oh, okay okay but thank you and that's just a question of the day thanks for your time You're though appreciate welcome. it hello guys I hope you guys enjoyed that video if you did please be sure to like comment share subscribe turn on post notifications all this means a lot to me i say this in all my videos because it really means a lot to me thank you for your continued love and support i can't stop thanking you guys because you guys are just lovely thank you and i'll see you on the next one